because she's in some ways remembered as a slightly tragic character, um, I really wanted to exploit some of the, the chutzpah of that woman as well as the, the tragedy of her. Um, so I did enough research that I felt I could honour her. Um, yeah, so I, I looked through a lot of YouTube interviews, a lot of articles, I read books. I spoke to Baz, whose knowledge was fairly, and CM, whose knowledge is fairly encyclopedic. Gladys would have seen how dominant the Colonel was in Elvis's life. So she would have looked at that as a mother and gone, is this man, does this man have my son's, my only child's best interests at heart? Or does he have his own best interests at heart? And I think she decided it was the latter. I, they, you know, Baz mentioned that Vernon and Gladys were barely literate. So, and even, you know, I've, ha I've looked at copies of those contracts. They're pretty, they're pretty dense. And, you know, she wouldn't have known head nor tail what, what, what Elvis was signing himself up for. But Elvis was always therefore kind of beholden to the Colonel, grateful, but also stuck. And I think Gladys saw that. And I think fairly quickly she went, I I just think she just, I don't, she didn't like him. She didn't like his manner. I think she found him crude. Um, you know, she just, I think she smelled a rat. They adored each other and I think he had to do a lot of reassuring. Sometimes I think he had to mother Gladys and, and he was very good at talking her off the ledge. And he had to do that quite often. And at some point, to calm her down, he said, I will phone you, I will call you when I'm on the road, I'll call you every night. And I think he was um, ribbed a bit about that. But, I mean, I'm sure he didn't do it all the time, but he did it a fair old amount. He did call her. He called his mother. Um, I think she lived for those phone calls. And then they'd come back, and I think that was all kind of good, but then he'd be off again. And so, look, I just think she found solace in the bottle and, um, and just became more and more um, unwell and isolated. Just from an acting point of view, he's incredibly generous. He's very giving, like he will listen to what you are offering and he will take that and he will use it and, and he gives a lot of eye contact and he makes beautiful choices as an actor. Um, he sounds exactly like Elvis, <laughs> it's quite uncanny. Um, and then you go and watch him do his mu the musical numbers and singing and doing the choreography and going, well, tick, yes, perfect. And never complains, turns up on time. I mean, he really is the package deal. And, and um, we all feel blessed to have him in this role. I love that theatricality that he brings. And he loves that in actors. He is a, he's very much um, an actor's director. And by that, I mean, never has there once been a moment on set, and, and he has so much going on. You know, sets and a million cameras and this and that and schedules and time, blah, 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 and just it's all happening. But you've got a question about would Gladys do this in this particular moment, and you really need that question answered before they say action. I can always, and any of us can, any of the actors can go up to Baz and go, I just have a question. Yes, what is it? And, and it's always yes and, yes and. It's not all oh, no, 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 no. It's never that. It's, it's um, he will always take the time to make you feel comfortable about that moment and give you the green light to, to, to try it or give it a go or what have you. Um, because also he's quite brave in the fact that he will 
even if, I don't know, maybe he hadn't thought of doing that moment like that. It's like, well, that's worth a few takes anyway, because who knows what little trail that could lead to. Or, you know, so it's, he's very open to suggestion. Of course, he's got incredibly strong ideas about where he's going, what he, what he wants, but it's, it's not insecure in the fact that he, it's like, oh, no, no, it's just, yes, yes, let's try it, let's do it. Yes, let's. And that's so freeing for, for an actor.